Today we celebrate the feast of Saint Bartholomew, the Apostle, one of the twelve apostles of the Lord, and therefore one of the great pillars of the church. Saint Bartholomew was also likely known as Nathaniel, as according to today's gospel passage, one of the Lord's twelve apostles was one named Nathaniel, whom the Lord called in an amazing way and known for his great intellect and wisdom. There was no one else among the twelve apostles who can fit the description of Nathaniel except for Saint Bartholomew the Apostle. There was scant reference to him otherwise in the scriptures but church and apostolic traditions and histories had extensive details about the efforts and works of Saint Bartholomew including that of his ministry and his martyrdom how he died in the face of opposition and persecution against the Christians. Saint Bartholomew has been glorified, has been raised to the bliss and joy of heaven, as the Lord had promised to all who to all those who have been faithful to him. As we heard in our first reading today from the book of Revelation, we heard how St. John saw the vision of the New Jerusalem with the names of the apostles inscribed upon its gates. Thus, that is how the Lord will also treat all those who have been faithful who have been true to him all those who have given their lives to his cause like all the apostles and the holy saints and martyrs and the innumerable other holy men and women who have gone before us and whose lives have whose lives shone forth with great virtue and faith their works and examples should serve inspiration to all of us as Christians, God's beloved people and disciples on how each and every one of us should be living our own lives with faith. And therefore, all of us are reminded today that we cannot be idle in the living of our faith in life each one of us have been has been have been blessed and given the grace of God's love and kindness his gifts talents abilities and the various opportunities that have been presented to us we are all called and inspired to do our best that our lives may truly reflect our Christian faith and all that the Lord had taught us to do just as Saint Bartholomew, Bartholomew had done with his life and so may the Lord continue to guide and strengthen all of us in our every work and action in every moment of our lives May he inspire and empower all of us so that we may serve him ever more faithfully and with greater courage. In the manner that Saint Bartholomew and the other holy apostles, saints and martyrs had done.